Do you want to start learning a new skill or a bond? Or do you want to start creating a new fashion collection or a new illustration but you don't know where to start or what to do first? Have you ever wondered what to do when you don't know what to do? This is one of the biggest struggles my students and people emailing me are having. They want to do a bunch of amazing stuff, but they don't know where to start. They get paralyzed by the options, the possibilities, and the what-ifs that they get stuck for a while, quite a while. And it's happened to me too, more often than I'd like to admit, <laughs> yeah. And so that's why today I want to help you get started when you don't know what to do or where to start whether because you have too many options or because you're afraid of the outcome. So, let's start! Hi, I'm Karen Evola. I'm a fashion designer, fashion illustrator, and surface pattern designer, and I design, illustrate, and teach here in my channel and also on fashionstepbystep.com. Okay, the best and easiest way to start doing anything when you don't know what to do is to start with play. Yeah, that easy. When you don't know where to start, then start with, my, with what makes you happiest, with what makes you feel the most joyful. Start playing around or start with what's easier, but always start with joy. When you do things from a place of joy and play, you remove all the fears and judgment of what you're doing, the process, and the outcomes. And you can completely focus on the task and the happiness that it brings you. When you focus on starting with play, the options you have in front of you are dramatically reduced. You stop messing around with what you should do, should do, <laughs> and you pour your whole attention to what makes you happy, all the happiest. And besides feeling joyful and amazing for doing what makes you feel good, you're also opening yourself up for more opportunities. Because when you're doing something out of joy, you're also doing it with your heart and you're appearing the best of you in it. And instead of just delivering my results, my creations and my everything, you create something beautiful. At the beginning of this video, I mentioned that I've also felt stuck um, not knowing what to do and this actually happened last month. I kept myself stuck not knowing what to do for a couple of weeks. I just um, was, I just wrapped up a project for a client and I started to feel anxious and kind of desperate because I really didn't know what to do next. Um, um, I knew I should lead more clients, I knew I should network with some lawyers and influencers to get the word out of my work and my illustrations. I also knew I should create more videos, more blog posts, and more Instagram pics because when I work with clients, I get so focused on, on their projects and their work that I tend to um, forget a little bit about my own channels. I knew I should revamp my fashion illustration portfolio and create more illustrations and more designs. And I knew I should, I knew I should, I knew I should. I knew I should do a lot of things. So what did I do? <laughs> I got up from bed very late. I got out of the house. I watched Netflix. I played with my pups and I hung out with my husband and pretty much anything that could distract me from making a decision. That's what I did. <laughs> I kept doing that for a couple of weeks, feeling a bit more anxious at a time, and more guilty day by day, until, until my husband, Alan, told me, why don't you start with what makes you feel more excited? Wouldn't that be easier? He told me that. And oh my goodness, he was all right. 
I love you, babe. <laughs> so I did everything from my paper planner, everything from Charlo, and everything from my own head. And I started asking myself, what's the most exciting thing for me right now? What's the most exciting thing for me right now? What's the most exciting thing for me right now? That was the only question in my head. And it hit me. I responded to myself, I want to create more personal projects. I want to grow this amazing community around fashion step by step. And I want to be of more of, of more help to them. And I'm excited about moving to Italy this year too. So those are the things that get me the most thrilled and the most excited at the moment of recording this. And those, uh, those things became my primary focus. So I decided to create a printable and illustrated travel planner. I decided to create more videos and posts and illustrations. I decided to set up a Patreon page for everyone eager to get more out of me and this channel. And that's, and that's what I'm starting to do right now. I'm starting with play. So it's time for you to try it right now. Grab a piece of paper and a pen Take a deep breath <laughs> and ask yourself, what's the most exciting thing for me right now? Now write it down. Sometimes the answer isn't as clear as we'd like it to be because there are so many things in our heads. But keep writing what's the most exciting thing for you at this moment and take note of the patterns or repeating words. Then. Go and do the thing with all your heart and trust in yourself that you'll make it as good as it can be. Okay, so that's it for today. I really hope this video and this little tip have inspired you to take action right now. And now I would love you to tell me in the comments what's the most exciting thing for you right now and how will you start with play? If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of my future videos, and share this video with your friends. Everyone's invited! <laughs> also, if you want to support me in the creation of more videos like this, and more artwork and more illustrations like those I have in my Instagram account, now you can you can become uh, <laughs> Oh my gosh! Now you can become a patron and well I have a lot of great goodies for you and for everyone pledging and helping me create more of what I love and more of what I want. <laughs> so head to my patreon to learn more about it and join, join me. <laughs> okay so see you on the next video, bye!